Hey, what's up, guys? This is Iwa Designer, but you can call me JMS. <laughs> and I'm joined today by uh, the one and only Siggy. Hello. Uh, today, I'm going to be showing you how to install Forestry uh, on TechIt. This, this is just for the client at the moment, uh, but I will be posting a server video later on uh, how to install it then. Uh, but yeah, let's get started. So, you want a fresh tech kit and the latest version which is 3.1.2 at this time and percent app data percent obviously to open up your roaming folder uh, technical launcher and tech it okay uh, an easy fix for the forestry mod is just to put like Z uh, before the forestry client but that unfortunately that doesn't work on servers so basically in this video I'm setting you up for the next stage which is for servers and that's for running your server but you can just join servers with this mod installed now uh, so uh, you open up mods and you look for EE2 client right this is the equivalent exchange client and you want to open that with WinRAR if you don't have that we'll put link in the description for it Yep, I'll do that, yep. Uh, right. So, uh, you open up your equivalent exchange client and you'll see all these folders build craft code chicken, equivalent exchange forestry, industrial craft, meta imp. Uh, basically, uh, the forestry, you want to delete that folder. Uh, so, there you see me just doing that there, shift delete if you don't know. Uh, so now that will be compatible with forestry. So what you want to do is drag the forestry client, which will be in the description, download to that, and you just just place it into there. Oh god, I think I rod it. Shit, I did. Crap, that's not good. That is not good. What the hell is it? There it is. Uh, don't do that. Don't don't put it in a raw file. I did that by accident. Uh, I'll, I'll just this will be easier. All right, so I'm going to copy it, Control C, and paste it in the mods folder. There we go. So there's the forestry client, and it's in TechIt mods folder. So now, what you want to do is run uh, Tech Technic Launcher. And select tech it from the drop down menu obviously. And log in. Alright, and this shouldn't work. But it leads you on to the next stage. Uh, so it'll crash. But it'll create a forestry in the config. Uh, so it'll just say Mojang for a while and then it'll crash in a minute wait for it to do that. Have a little lie down in my bed. Um, for the next video I'll be showing you on my main computer. This is just a laptop. It's one from the lag. Yeah, if there is any. I doubt there will be. So there you go, it's crashed. Uh, there you go, Minecraft. It's crashed. Uh, so just close that. Just wait for it to close. It, it, it can take a while. End task. Come on, there we go. Okay. Then what you want to do is go back into your uh, te tech it and under dot technical and sure. And then you want to go config forestry base dot conf. I think. Uh, yep. And then you want to go open with. Crap! I don't have open with. All right. I'll just open up a notepad. Basically, what you'd want to do is like open, open it up with Notepad. There you go. That and this, the mill, clashes with Industrial Craft Two, I think. So, what you want to change this to is two five two, which is a free item ID, and you just do file, file, save, and that will be saved. And now, fingers crossed, if you open up. Uh, Technic. Pardon it. Uh, log in. 
Now this should work. Please, hopefully it'll work. Otherwise I'll have to do this video again. Come on. Drum roll. Come on. Sorry about my uh Ah, oh, there you go, look, it's done. 40 Two mods. Yeah. So you should originally say 41 mods, so if it says 42, you should know that you have no more. Yeah, indeed. Uh, so I'll just open up a single player world. Uh, uh, yeah, just create a new world. Put it in creative. Uh, Flatland, just to. Yes, there you go. Uh, and then create new world, and this will work. I'll just give it a little demo of forestry. There we go. Right, so let's just look for a peat fired engine. There you go, that peat fired engine. Uh, so forestry is enabled. Uh, in the forestry dot jar, I have already, uh, I've, I've already uh, patched it for Sfax, uh because that's just simple. But like, you open the the dot jar and then you can uh, change the textures from there. Uh, so yeah, as you can see, this is all working. Forestry and tech it three point two point one. Uh, thanks for watching, subscribe, comment, rate, whatever, there's no rate anymore, I've just been informed, uh, you, you know, but have fun with Tech It in, uh, and Forestry Mod, and next time I'll be showing you how to do it for a server.